Hello there, you are welcome to His Cup TV. My name is Colin Nanaya Abebese, and in today's episode or uh, lesson, we are going to look at the origin and migration of the Akan. Uh, now, the Akans are the uh, the major ethnic groups in in Ghana today. Uh, they form more than about 70 percent or so, like more than 50 percent of the of the current population of Ghana. And so today we will look at the origin and migration of the Akan. But before we go and watch a short uh, documentary on the origin and migration of the Akan, let's look at our lesson objectives for today. So by the end of this lesson, you should be able to um, trace the origin and uh, migration of the Akan uh, from, of course, wherever they came from to settle in their present uh, location in Ghana and basically uh, that is what our lesson objectives for today uh, would be. Now before we also uh, watch the video, bear in mind that there are so many um, um, traditions uh, regarding the origin of the Akan. Um, there are so many, so many traditions. Some say the Akans of course came from Ethiopia. Another school of thought also says the Akans came from ancient Ghana. Others also think that the Akans came from Israel. You know, uh, there hasn't been any one sufficient uh, theory which explains the origin uh, of the Akan. Uh, and so in the video that we will watch very shortly, we have just assembled some of the school of thought. And so if your school of thought is not uh, mentioned in the video, it does not mean that uh, your school of thought is not true or the information in the video is not true but that is what oral tradition has and that is one of the disadvantages of oral tradition because most of these uh, traditions of origin are for i mean are found in oral traditions and, and very often for this is the difficulty you may not have one um, narrative and so if you have any different um, narrative outside what we have uh, presented to you you can share that in the in the comment section um, for us and then also if you agree with our theories of the Akans uh, tradition of origin then you can also agree with us in the comment section if you have any other extra information of course regarding the origin of the Akan you can also share that in the comment section so let's watch the Akan and then we are we are waiting to hear from you in the comment section the Akan occupy a greater portion of the forest and savanna lands of southern Ghana. They constitute about half of the present population of the country. The Akan speak the Akan language, which has been divided into two, Fante and Tree. The Fante-speaking people live some 80 miles along the coast and some 30 miles inland. The main tree-speaking groups include the Adanse, Equiapim, Akwemu, Achim, Asante, Asin, Denchira, and Kwewu. Other Akan speaking peoples are the Ahanta, Bono, Nzima, Sefi, Chifu, and Wasa. They speak a common language, Chi, a dialect of that language. They also have a common social and political institutions and practices, common religious beliefs, chieftaincy and a common calendar, and a number of matrilineal and patrilineal clans into which the entire population is divided. The origins of the Akan pose a difficulty in the history of Ghana. The reason is that there is no single theory which sufficiently explains exactly where they originated from. A school of thought led by J.B. Dankwa and Eva Mirowitz points out that the Akans first lived in Ethiopia. From there, they later moved to Egypt and then came to settle in the ancient Ghana Empire of Western Sudan. This view has, however, been challenged in the light of new historical and linguistic research. Based on the new evidence, another school of thought, led by historians like Edubuahi and Harry Johnson, claim that the Akan lived in Yoruba land in modern Nigeria. From there, 
they crossed the Mono and Volta rivers and entered the Afram plains. The Akan later traveled northwards but turned again southwards to settle in the Pra of Finn Basin. From this region, each Akan group migrated to settle in its present place.